What is up guys, my name is Farzy here. Are you sick of your old XP farms breaking because of the new updates? I am too. As you see right here, I had a really, really good XP farm and it broke because of the aquatic update aka 1.13. But have no fear, we have a solution. Let's get right to it. So here is the older farm. As you can see, little water stream. The skeletons or zombies come riding in, they get caught in this stream, and they go up with a sign and water and sign, and it was so perfect, but now, the new updates make the skeletons sit there, cause they're so smart and sneaky. But don't worry, we have a new way to solve this problem, let's go to the updated farm. So here is the updated farm. I know it's a little bit intimidating, but here is how you're gonna fix your mobs to get back up there and make your farm work oh so smooth. So, the skeleton will do the test. He sits here on ice, goes through the water, going faster and faster, gets pulled into a stream, and goes up and flying into the air. It's not 100%, but it's about 95. It's very effective. I've had very few skeletons stop there, but they get pushed over anyway, so it's a win-win. See, lazy little sneaky devil, he got stuck, but watch Mr. Skeleton number three come in and push him over to safety. Get in there. Yeah, and you go up too. There we go. As you can see, no clogs, it's pretty easy, and it's very efficient. Now let's teach you guys how to build this bad boy. Alright guys, before we start, I want to let you guys know, this is just the mob elevator. This is not the whole XP farm. So if you want to make a whole XP farm, go down below in the description. My XP farm is there. It's for skeletons and zombies. It's highly effective, but please, please make sure you put the new elevator in that I'm teaching you today because the old one does not work. So please do the new one. Let's get started. So you're going to start off with one, two, three, four pieces of ice down, then one below that in front of it, one, two, three. So seven total, but the back three or the front three, right? Three, front three rather are under it after that you're gonna surround it in a glass ring one piece is okay but if you're really rich you could do something like this and go under but that's not necessary just do the one ring but after that you're gonna raise it up one higher with glass after that you're gonna put down a piece of water at the back of it let it flow all the way next up put a sign in the third or the middle block of the lower ice. Make sense? The middle block of the lower three blocks of ice. Next up, you are going to take that little two, two and one, those five blocks right there, and raise them up as high as you need to go. Normally it goes about 21 to 23 blocks. I can... I think that's it, but about 20 blocks-ish if you want to have the skeletons die with like one hit or two hits. But raise it all the way up. After that, you are going to make signs all on that column or row, whatever it is. But you know where that sign went? Put signs all the way up to the top. After that, you're going to do two things. You are going to put soul sand, replacing that last block of ice right there. And you're going to put a water stream on this thing. Now, you might be able to get away with putting a water source block at the top, letting it stream down. But I've had some bugs with that, so I prefer just to do a water bucket on every single level. So take a water bucket, go boom, 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 boom. And that is it. The skeleton will do the test. Let's actually go to um, easy mode just to double check it. But Mr. Skeleton, do the honors once again. Go up there, show me what you got. Boom, and he goes up, and it's perfect. So guys, there is your fix for any XP farm after 1.13, specifically the water elevator trick, but um, it's a big help because my farm got broken, a lot of farms got broken, and it's going to help you. So please, if you like the video, like the video. If you hate the video, go away. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and do all that good stuff. And I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.